Okay, in this video we're going to continue on where I'm going to be doing the measuring and uh, transferring this image to the grid on my drawing paper using my layout 555 pencil. Okay, I'm just going to explain really quick here what I'm doing uh, because pretty much this whole video is going to be more of the same. I'm using a proportional divider here to get exact distances um, of the top of the eye, the side of the eye, and so forth. And then I'm marking it on my drawing paper and the respective square that's represented by the square that is in the photo. So for example, if you'll notice that the square that I'm working in right now is uh, you know two across, two over. So the same is done, you know, I go to the same coordinates or quadrant if you like on my reference photo and I start to put in little marks to give me um, where I want certain details to start and end and so forth. And I'm doing this right now with this uh, lion's uh, right eye. But um, as I go on uh, later on in this video, you're going to start to notice that I don't use the proportional divider that much and I pretty much freehand it because it's, it's not that difficult and uh, the, the divider is really just an option but for the eyeball I just wanted to get this really really precise and I wanted to show you how you can do this but for the most part you can eyeball most of this by just noticing the distances that certain details are from the sides of a square and just you know you can get very 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 close without the divider especially if you do this enough times and you practice enough times uh, you'll get really good at just eyeballing it and, and being able to see how far in a square you're going to put a line or a curve or whatever such as what I'm doing right here I'm drawing in this uh, end of the eye but here I use the proportional divider to give me the exact distances but later on I won't be doing that um, so anyway, if there's anything else that I need to jump in and say, I will. Meanwhile, I'm going to speed this up. Otherwise, it could be one long, boring video. So you can watch uh, as I go ahead and put the details uh, onto the grid.